Hi everyone, so it's a really, really different kind of video today. Um, for Christmas I got some new tarot cards and some dice, so I thought I would try and use them together. Now, for me this is a new spread that I've like invented myself, but someone else could very well have thought it up as well, it seems quite simple to me anyway. But I thought I'd share it in case it's not a spread that's already out there that someone's thought of. So what I did is I chose a 20-sided dice, a 10-sided dice, and an 8-sided dice. And I rolled those dice. And I received a 13, a 3, and a 1. So I drew the corresponding cards to those cards. So I got the Death, Empress, and the Magician. Then I added the 13 and the 3. Then I added the 3 and the 1. And then I added the 13 and the 1. So the first two numbers, the second two numbers, and then the first and the last numbers together. Give me the Tower, the Emperor, and Temperance. Then I added all three numbers together. 13, 3, and 1. Give me the Star. I read this as the past, as these two cards. This is the present, or the situation. This is the action needed. And then this is the likely outcome. I really like this read as well. So it's saying in my past, I had some divine intervention that brought about um, an end of a cycle and a start of a new one, or a promise of a new cycle at least. Then I had the Empress and the Emperor, which are divine counterparts. And I see that as me and my person who are currently in separation now because of the Tower and the Death card. Then for my action, I've got the Mag... Magus in this book, Magus, Magus in this deck, a uh, magician anyway, and temperance, which is manifestation and patience. So if I continue my manifestations and being patient, hopefully my outcome will be the star. Wish fulfillment. I really enjoyed this read. So if anyone else tries it, I'd love to know what your results were and if you enjoyed it. But I thought I would share it and I hope you like. Thanks. Bye.